dear students from today we are going to start another list of modules on databases database systems more precisely and the first module is on significance of database system that why we need database systems so the term database is basically refers to a collection of data that is multidimensional in the sense that internal links between its entries make the information accessible from a variety of perspectives and in contrast the flat file is representing only one dimension that storage system meaning that it presents the information from a single point of view for example we want to store some information and um, in this information system so for example we want to store the information related to marketing department purchasing department personal department payroll department and customer service department so the structure which is on the top of this figure highlighted now is basically file oriented information system so in this file oriented information system everything or many things have been stored at multiple places making it redundant so for example the employees record is stored with the personal department and which employees have been paid have been stored by the payroll department so this means that all of the information of employees is stored over here and all of the information of employee can be stored over here this could be one way and the next way could be that the required information of employees is stored over here and the information related to payroll can be stored over here but if then payroll department needs some extra information which is not available in this module then it ask this module to give that information so if we want to add another employee we need to add it over here and here we want to add it similarly we want to delete if any employee has left our uh, department our company then that record need to be deleted from this file and from this file and similarly if we want to uh, perform a query for example i want to say that give me the list of all employees who has name ali and who lives in islamabad and who are given xyz salary so i need to uh, query this file and then this file and then i need to merge all of the things however the database oriented information system is all aggregated so we have marketing department purchasing department personal department payroll department and customer service department all are integrated into one into one place that is called the integrated database and that also have a management component that manages that database so what would be the advantages of database helps in making informed decision some of the advantages we have seen in the previous slide that if you want to add delete edit or query so the information stored in database will be helpful and there are some other advantages for example we can it can help to make us informed decisions especially when combined with data mining technologies and the systems like google ebay amazon and in local context of pakistan the company of nadra fbr etc they provide web interfaces to its client with the databases available backside so if we summarize today's module we have learned about databases flat file systems and we have seen many advantages of storing data into the database irrespective of the flat file 